Hey, good evening, y'all. Appreciate you reaching out. Nice to meet you. So I got the uh, 2024 Cedar Creek 380 mud here. You know who you are. This is a special video just for you. But dive on in here. I'm glad we're kind of in the dusk of the day. Kind of get to see the cool lights going on here. But got that Kurt Air Ride thin box here. Frameless automotive windows. Definitely uh, give it that that modern appeal for sure. Said we'll kind of take it around slow just to make sure you get to see everything. Get a very good idea of what you'd be looking at here. Leash latch if you got puppy dogs. Big awning. We'll get to see the back side of it. But big power awning. You're going to have your slide toppers there. 80 20 tinted on the glass. So you can kind of see in there because it's, it's getting darker now. But during the daytime, pretty darn dark. Double axles. Six point auto level, which is hydraulic. Good look on everything here. So just take a cruise around the outside. Sure. The nice rims on there. Sorry for the mud. Gets a little nasty out here sometimes. So, big pass through, big, big pass through. This is actually uh, pretty darn unique. I haven't seen too many of them. 110 GC, or 110 outlets there. Spray your port. It's gonna be a little loud back here next to the highway, so I apologize if you can't hear me too good. Rear loading on the pass through, which is a pretty darn cool thing. Definitely put tons of gear back here. I don't mean to be too quick on the outside. It is a cold night out this way. Slide toppers, all the great big slides. So we're gonna have, I believe these are 10 gallons here. Um, 12 gallons here. 12 gallons on the water heater. Other side of the pass through, so we know what to expect there. It's a pretty fresh one, brand new. Really quite shiny, ain't even got dirty enough for another bath yet. So we're here. We're gonna have a all of our plumbing work all inside so that way if it gets frozen out here and, and stuff your lines won't freeze power disconnect all your different configurations city water you're gonna have a black tank flush there hydraulic control room so you can actually turn off each individual one if you have a problem and you need to just you know segregate that one that one slide This is pretty cool here. Uh, it took me a long time to find the touch panel, but that is for your auto level. Sticker information there, just in case you might like it. Oh. Cool. So we'll check out our uh, generator area here real quick, and then we'll get inside and go warm up a little bit. So lots of room, lots of space. Yeah, you can't put a generator in there, but pretty much every anything else that you might like as well. <laughs> Nothing like versatility. That's what that's what makes camping easy. Uh, we already seen the propane tanks in there, so let's go ahead and go inside. So this does have the more ride safety rail here, which definitely cool. Three solid steps here. Go ahead and put this back on real quick. Really darn easy. So it's the 380 mud. We're taking good full benefit and advantage of this today because it was a little rainy out. But you got all the room for shoes, some sensor, some sensor lights, cabinet, nice, nice hardware, nice hardware, solid. Hardwood cabinets, 
coat racks. So you're gonna have everything in one pretty easy, convenient place. Definitely uh, pretty intuitive, darn easy to use, and you'll master it after you go through the program one time. There's 30 amp solar controller, plenty of room for upgrades if you wanted to add more. Big fan of the different wood just to kind of add that pop to it. Well, let's get ready for it. And welcome to the 380 MUD. It is one that really speaks for itself. They are uh, quite breathtaking. There's not even many homes that you'll see that are just as pretty. So you got your, your day shades kind of darkened up here. Really nice worm, worm wood on the wood. Got an eave that comes out. Nice chairs to match. Gorgeous kitchen. Gorgeous, we'll get around a little closer too. You're gonna have a pop up here for some extended bar space if you like. Ambiance lights down there. Big, big Furion fridge, residential, well, 12 volts still, but I believe we're looking at around 20, 23 cubic foot. Looks like we got a lock on here. There we go. Big, big old fridge there. So you'll be paired with, you'll have your freezer down below. Freezer down below. So the countertops are, are very pretty. Nice, I want to say marble. I don't know if it's what they use nowadays, if marble's still around, but you know, it definitely looks and feels like it. <laughs> cool spray. So, white over here but black on the, the cook side the contrast definitely adds a very nice look to it it's very modern but uh you know hey i think they had definitely had a good idea there huge microwave furion you can see the um kind of waves in the glass it's a cool touch paper towel holder it's the little things when it comes down to the big things so we'll start up here with uh the mud room you got all your master lights and such going up you still see that nice different thick you know it's the things that they did differently that kind of stand out that that just separate it and add that great touch to things on here so this is uh, you know, a big room that makes this particularly special. You're gonna have a loft up here, USB chargers, outlets, a ladder. You're going to have a really, really pretty, nice half bath in here. There's Alex, what's going on everybody? Nice to see ya. So, if you can see just the shape of the sink, it's almost like a ramp, really cool. Granules. So I was looking, you um, porcelain toilet, touch a home there. Got a kick out bar, you need some extra room. You're gonna have plenty of wards, pretty deep enough. They even put your clothes hanger in there. Definitely uh, more than enough to have a guest for a little bit longer than a short amount of time so I'm gonna set you down right over about about here we'll see if we can put this down real quick so you got a latch here all you do lift up bring her on down look at this the legs kick out for you themselves you know camping's supposed to be convenient right so go locked and loaded into position that's pretty full-on bed right there I would say up here still got the headboard and you can see that so you know quick quick conversion to um, you know full bedroom up here so that's pretty darn cool 
if you had board you get a look up there. And I'm gonna put that back up later. Well <laughs> won't sl slow you down. But everything just has such a nice touch to it. Their quality is really fantastic. They do a really excellent job. Big fan. Big big fan. Big fan. So this is the uh, Livingston interior here. It looks like a cloth, but it's actually more of a vinyl. Pretty thick, pretty heavy duty. These are power. Pamo. So that's pretty slick there. You know they didn't give you they didn't they didn't leave you much to be wanting. So in here, let me uh, see if we can find the latch for it. We'll have a pretty neat surprise. They always hide things. But we do have a hidden pantry here. <laughs> Just gotta get her open. Grab a log. Okay, where you at, you rascal? Well, apologize for the slow down here, but it does have the hideaway pantry. Just gotta find it. Let's do this. Bet you'll be right back here. Pull this out a little bit. No. Okay, well I apologize for that and I can get that a little better looking um, later. However, I do apologize for 